Danny here with Athlete's Potential. We're going to go over some uh, hollow rock regressions that we like to do for those of you that uh, can't do a full on hollow rock or you can't hold proper technique while you do that. It's still a great uh, globally flexed position that we like to get our athletes into. And this is where we like to start. So for those of you who don't know what a hollow rock is, it's where we lay on, our, on the ground, lower back is flat, arms overhead, legs are out straight in this hollow full body flex position. Well, that's great if you can do it correctly. If not, we want to regress that down a little bit. And this is where we start. So number one, we're going to start in this position here. We're going to be knees up, back is flat. We're going to take our arms. You can either reach straight forward or kind of up at an angle. What I want you to think about is, is your back flat on the ground? If not, tuck your butt under so that it is. And as your shoulder blades raise up, it will flatten out more as well. What we don't want is for us to be extended and be able to get our hand under our back. So tuck the butt under, big breath in, blow all the air out, get tight. We're gonna take our shoulder blades and we wanna actually lift them straight up until we are actively holding this position. Now, I'm a big believer in the fact that you need maximal tension. So if you're gonna do this, and we're gonna hold this for 10 to 20 seconds, I want you to literally think, get as tight as you possibly can. Imagine someone who's gonna come by and punch you in the stomach at any time. So create maximal, maximal tension, hold that position, 10 to 20 seconds, let yourself relax, okay? If you wanna make it a little bit harder, you can kick your legs up straight, you can come up into the same position and hold there. If you wanna make that a little bit harder, you can actually raise your arms over your head and you can end in this position here, okay? So think 10 to 20 seconds, max contraction, let yourself relax until you're fully recovered, okay? Try to do maybe five to 10 bouts of that, controlling the stomach and the pelvis and keeping your back flat and on the ground. All right, thanks guys.